right, all right. I had to switch cameras there. There we go. Okay, all right, all right. This this, this is my first time doing this uh, uh, Periscope thing here. What's up, what's up, everybody? It's Andre Park, and uh, I am at the park. You know, my first time doing Periscope live, and it's, uh, it's something else. I tell you what, uh, today is just... Like I said, my first time doing Periscope. I'm over here at the park chilling. Got my wife and daughter back there hanging out, you know, chilling at the park and swinging on it. Yeah, they can see it. Yeah, yeah, wave, y'all. Say, what's up? All right, that's, that's, that's my favorite, too, right there. They're at the park. And, you know, the good thing about being homeschooled, about being an entrepreneur, is you can actually come to the park when all the other kids are still at school. Uh, they're still doing their schoolwork. And you can have the park to yourself. It's pretty fun. It's pretty exciting. And, you know, we're just out here. And when I came out here, I noticed it was it was some other kids out here. And, you know, we had some skateboarders. Uh, if you see some kids are back there, they're playing basketball. And they're doing different things. And, you know, the young kids haven't got out of school yet. So I'm kind of wondering, um, are these kids really supposed to be in school? Or are they skipping school and why they at the park right now because <laughs> school is not out yet but anyway that's another subject and school is out yet well, well see when you don't work no job you don't know what time people out of school you don't know what time they doing what they doing huh oh, oh the parents got to get off work okay so the kids out of school but the parents not retired so they got to wait till they get off work and then they can bring the kids to the park that's what it is okay got it so today what I want to just kind of kick it real quick on my first uh, live broadcast on Periscope. And if anybody's on here watching, no, I am not the most technical person in the world. So, you know, give a brother a break. But here we go. We're doing it live in living color. One of my mentors said, he said, Andre, just do a scope. Do a scope and do a scope. So, what? You see how high they swing y'all? She can go to the top. Take to the top. I bet you won't bail out. No, no. <laughs> now, if you're from up north, you know what bail out is. It's basically you swing in it, and when you get all the way to the top, you just jump right off the swing and actually bail out the swing. But what I'm going to talk about today real quick on Periscope, that's what's up, is um, who you're hanging around. You know, who you're hanging around. I came in. And I guess I haven't been around young adults, teenagers for a while. And I saw this kid and he had on these shorts and you can see his whole butt. And, you know, I got a 10 year old daughter. I'm trying not to get my 10 year old daughter to see this young man's whole buttocks just hanging out, you know, from behind his shorts. And it, it was so funny when I saw him walk by. Then I saw his little two or three friends behind him and all of them had their butts hanging out the same exact way. And then I looked over there at the, the other guys that were skateboarding, and I looked at them. They all had on tight jeans, and, you know, they were skateboarding with their tank tops on, and they were all dressed alike. And it brought me back to what one of my mentors taught me when, you know, I was a mechanic working in Goodyear, working at the tire shop, sweating, working all hard every day to try to make a living and pay bills. And, you know, on a Friday like this, I'll be jacked out my mind because it's Friday, it's payday, I'm going to get my check, and I'm going to go cash it. And he was telling me, Andre... The reason why you're that way is because you're a product of who you're hanging around. He said, it's bottom line. The people you hang around with, the people who you associated with on a day-to-day -day basis, eventually you will be like those individuals if you're not like them right now. And he said, you can do it anytime you want to. Identify the five people that you're listening to the most, you're talking to the most, you're hanging out with them the most, and you write down on paper how much income that they're making. So if you're five people, you're talking to all the time, they make about $50,000 a year. He said, well, sooner or later, you'll be making $50,000 a year in income. So what does that mean? It simply means this is, if you want to change something in your life right now, you can change that with some of your associations. Now, one of the hardest things that I kind of had to challenge with is some of the associations with some of my best friends. You know, there were some family members that necessarily weren't doing the things that I wanted to be doing in life. Oh, y'all y'all rolling off? Oh, yeah, oh they, they were messing with me. They were doing something behind my back. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. I see how y'all doing that. All right, anyway. Oh, so now she's uh, climbing up on the spider things. Can you go all the way to the top? 
Make it to the top. Cheer on, y'all. Give her some hearts to let her make it to the top. Come on. You can do it, Zeta. Let's go. Take it to the top. Take it to the top. Take it to the top. She's going to the top, y'all. She's heading to the top. Who wants to go to the top? Sometimes you got to take a step out. You got to head on up so you can go to the top. There she go. She's heading up. She's going to the top. They're giving you a lot of hearts, Zeta. She's going to the top. We need some friends to go to the top with us, y'all. Y'all ready to go to the top? We only hang around people that's going to the top. That's it. We only people that's going to the top. Uh-huh. Come on. One more. One more step. Come on, y'all. Cheer on. She almost at the top. Zeta, everybody give you a heart. She almost at the top, baby. Push her. One more step. All right, well, maybe next week she'll make it all the way to the top. But anyway, to make it to the top, you, you need to hang around people that's, that is at the top. Bottom line, hang around people that are at the top. So let's say your friends, they're not at the top. Family members, they're not at the top. Well, Andre, how do I hang around people? I, I hear this all the time. Well, I don't know millionaires personally like you do. I don't know people that are billionaires like you do. So how do I hang around people like that? Well, it's real simple. Look right now. We're on something called Periscope that is on the internet, that is global. Do you know how many millionaires and billionaires are on Periscope and are scoping? Do you know how many millionaires and billionaires are on Facebook, on Twitters, that have blogs, that have Instagrams, that have social media accounts that you can follow them, you can see what they're talking about, that has audio programs, that's got videos, that's got YouTube, that are putting things out every single day that you can listen to, that you can follow, and you can be inspired by. It doesn't mean you have to know them personally. Once I learned that concept, guess what? I spent the hour a day listening to millionaires in my audio programs. I spent time reading books by millionaires and billionaires. I went to events and conventions that were being hosted by people that I wanted to be like. It wasn't luck that allowed me to retire at 28. It wasn't some, oh, something fell out of the sky and all of a sudden, bam, it happened for me. I started to change my association. So if you don't want to be the person in the park with your pants sagging down to your knees and your butts hanging out, quit hanging around folks that's walking around with their booties hanging out all day long. Start hanging around people that are eagles, that are flying high, that are going somewhere, that's making some things happen with their lives. That's when you'll start to fly high and start to go places and hang out and do some things going on. Oh, now she's trying to climb up on something else, y'all. So anyway, that's my, my thing I want to share with everybody today. This is my first Periscope. Uh, if you're following me on Twitter, shout out to you. Uh, if you're on Instagram, shout out to you. Wherever you are, say that yes, it's true. I, hashtag, I know that's right. It, it is the truth. <laughs> All right, they saying bye, y'all. So peace out. Slide down. She's she going to slide down for y'all. Slide on down. Show them how we do it. Lift your legs up. Bam. <laughs> She don't want to slide down because it's hot. It's going to be hot on her. Oh, Princess Zeta. But anyway, y'all, love y'all. Peace out. Much love to you. Take care. God bless. And I truly look forward to seeing you on the beaches of the world. Hang out with some people that you really want to be like. And trust me, your life will start to transform. Have a good one, y'all. Take it easy. Peace.